again, YouTubers. Delta Merrick's here with another video game review. This one is going to be of the Green Lantern video game from adaptation of the movie, but it's something Invasion of the Manhunters. I don't remember the name. It wasn't really that good to me. Uh, you play as Hal Jordan, the superhero who becomes, or the guy who becomes a Green Lantern in the movie, the Green Lantern, and in comics, of course. And it takes place immediately after the movies. You can argue it. It's true. You're at a, some kind of ceremony thing where they're celebrating the defeat of that big monster thing. And the place is attacked by Manhunters, who are basically the ones that were before the Green Lanterns. So you have to mission to mission to mission. It's just basically, mission's over. And when the mission starts up again, you're in the same spot. You have to just keep going. Except whenever they go to some little stupid space scene. Uh, you can upgrade your powers, upgrade your, get new stuff, get new attacks. They were pretty cool. At the beginning, it kind of sucked, but, you know. By the end, I had the piston attack where you fight with four pistons and knock people out. It was pretty cool. You know, for a Green Lantern game, it's actually, it's actually good, but they took a lot of stuff out of it. Like, you can't fly except at certain points. You know, you expect to jump in the air and press A again to work, fly around for a little bit. You can't do that. It would have been so much easier on combat sometimes that way. So, yeah, they're like, no, we don't want to do that. Um, I'm not getting too far into plot because there really isn't any. All you're doing is fighting the Manhunters and trying to recover the fear energy. Uh, by the end of the game, you find out it's... The person who's behind all this is the guy's son that gave Kyle Jordan the ring. Okay, spoiled. Oh well. You defeat him. He's captured or killed. I don't know. End the game. You're done. You can do a new game plus, which just makes the combat easier. Whatever. You can fight the big dudes. You can fight at the beginning of the game. Had you know had a health bar, all that stuff. But. They're much easier because you have most of all the powers. I would give the game a 4 out of 10. Basically because it was a good attempt. You had the good powers. You had the good everything. It wasn't long enough. For one, it was not long enough at all. I had to take breaks half the time. Just, I was just getting bored of it. And basically, if you're not a fan of a Green Lantern you're really not going to play it. You're not really not going to have any fun with it. So, yeah. Green Lantern. Manhunter something. 4 out of 10. This is Delta Marriott.